So, hi. Today is Star Wars Refrigerator Day. And that sounds like about the craziest thing I could imagine saying. But my refrigerator is in the dining room now. And where there used to be a refrigerator, there's a big space. So, the story is, and it's a crazy story, um, <clears throat> I was watching, I think it was MSNBC, and this was around Thanksgiving, and they advertised Albert Lee Appliances. And that's here in the Pacific Northwest area. We've got one here in Tacoma, not far from where I live. Um, they were giving away a GE Profile Star Wars themed refrigerator. And it's a really nice fridge. And we don't need a fridge. We had a fridge. It's a perfectly great fridge. And I'll show you the fridge in a little bit, but it's kind of hard to get to right now. Um, but we have a lot of Star Wars in our world, and I couldn't help but enter this contest. So I entered this contest, and the next thing you know, we own a Star Wars refrigerator. Yeah, they called me. I, I was driving by Albert Lee Appliances last Sunday, and got on my way to the food get some food stuff and I it's kind of on my way to the grocery store and I was like hmm I wonder when they're gonna do that drawing and it turned out they're gonna do that drawing the very next day and they called me up and they're like congratulations you win a refrigerator and somehow I wasn't surprised because it sort of seems like that's something we need in this kitchen I don't know how much Jean agrees with me on that but it's a really nice fridge, and it's going to go in this little spot over here. And Jeff is on his way over now with his truck, and we're going to go down to Fife to the warehouse where they are and pick up a fridge. And it's going to have droids on it and chewy and stuff. So I will try and video all of that because people really do win these things. You know, who guessed? All right, here we go. <laughs> so we're at Albert Lee Appliances, and we're all backed up to the loading dock. And these guys are going to set us up with a refrigerator in just a minute. They're talking all about the Star Wars stuff. There is much Star Wars stuff that everybody's got. We're all big fans. So that's kind of cool. So we will uh, check this thing out in just a minute and we'll see how well it gets into this truck, which should be great because this is the gigantic truck over here. Jeff has a huge truck. And when we get it home, uh, we'll see how we're going to get it into the house and installed. And yeah, Albert Lee is great because they're setting us up with a Star Wars fridge. All right, we'll see you back at the house. So the truck is loaded up. They've got it all in there, and it's shrink-wrapped in a pile of plastic. But as we're driving down the road, that's what it'll look like behind the truck, which is cool. So we're getting it all strapped in there now, and it'll be nice and tight before we... Protection! <laughs> Protection! Before we take it up the hill, because we've got to go up a pretty good-sized hill to get to our house. And... Uh, we don't really want it tilting over when we're like at a 15, 20 degree angle going up the hill. So we'll see how this goes. Okay. Time for the reveal. crazy in here because we have lots of people working on trying to get all this stuff figured out. Okay, so after working out getting the water connected, which was tricky because it took a special kind of a hose connector, but we went back to the Albert Lee place and they were like, oh yeah, here you go, here's your hose connector. <laughs> um, got that all put together and installed and it was not as easy as the instructions said, but it never is. And so... Here we go. This is the new refrigerator. And it's totally pretty. 
it's very Star Wars, and it's going to go along really well with all of the other Star Wars things that we're planning in the kitchen. I mean, we've got some droids over here, and you can see we've got, like, glassware and stuff, and all of this glass stuff was stuff that we won at a show a couple of years ago from Zack. You can see the little Zack logo on this guy right here. Um, so we've got a bunch of those, and... You know, you win the Growler. We won two of these, actually. There's another one out in the studio. And <clears throat> it goes really well with the fridge. And this fridge is actually really nice. Um, got It's got the freezer on the bottom, and it's counter depth, which was way better than our other fridge as far as the amount of space that we have available. And oh, it's got a little something on there already. A little smush. Um, I'm going to open it. Yeah, we can open it up and see how it looks inside. It's full of pokes up there. And this is huge on the inside. It's much, much bigger than our old fridge was. Even though our old fridge took more space. So I just think it's just a better use of space. Having no bar in the middle, that separator bar between the refrigerator and freezer kind of got in the way. And now the freezer is on the bottom and the ice maker hasn't started yet but the water's connected so it should be coming along eventually and yeah it's full of stuff so thanks for watching and sorry there's no art this time but we're tired so no art on this video uh, don't forget to like and subscribe and you'll see art on the next video all right thanks have fun. See you soon.